The annual mad dash by last minute Christmas shoppers is underway and stores aren't the only place that are going to be crowded. We have the details from Chris Clackham. The Saturday before Christmas is already behind us and like last year, the busiest shopping day of the season. I've been feeling the pressure for weeks, but even more so now that we're uh, less than a week away. So retail experts are again expecting deep discounts over the next few days at brick and mortar stores on practically everything because it's too late to get online. You're definitely out of luck in terms of making it there in time without paying those heavy expedited shipping fees. Rebecca George with RetailMeNot.com says most consumers prefer doing last minute shopping in store and a survey by the Council of Shopping Centers found 92 percent of them still have last minute shopping to do but aren't panicking. The consumer has all the information they need in the palm of their hand so they want to have updated sales and inventory in real time. That's something that the big box stores really need to be aware of this week. Keep in mind, if shopping between now and Friday, for me, roads are going to be jammed. More Americans than ever before, over 100 million are traveling this week to be home for Christmas. You're not the only one last minute shopping. <laughs> well, as the new year approaches, you're likely going to be making one or a list of resolutions. An online survey conducted on behalf of Brandman University finds 67% of American adults are making resolutions for 2016. Of those, 33% said they'll be making financial resolutions, whether it be pay off debt or save more. The study found financial resolutions to be the second top resolution. The top was weight loss or more exercise. And I think what making them is no, that's easy. It's sustaining them is the challenge. Exactly. Eat more I sugar. I completely concur. <laughs> yeah. yeah, absolutely. Well, we Challenges in hockey? That's right, Minnesota Wild taking on Dallas tonight, and then the Timberwolves in action as well. We've got basketball and hockey coming your way.